डॉक्टर सस्मित पात्रा सिक्स मिनट्स थैंक यू ऑनरेबल चेयरमैन सर On behalf of my party, the Biju Janata Dal, and my leader Sri Navin Patnaik Ji, I rise to support both the bills brought together by the government today. At the outset, I congratulate the Parliament, the government, the Honourable Home Minister for the historic judgment by the Honourable Supreme Court today on the abrogation of 370. It vindicates the stand of the Parliament. It vindicates the stand of the government. and it vindicates the stand of the biju janata dal because we forcefully supported the entire abrogation bill on 2019 august honorable chairman sir i also welcome the decision of the government to bring these two bills because it indicates the strong intent of the government to ensure that whatever is required in order to prepare jnk for democratic elections is being readied and with that we will very soon probably next year have a full fledged vidhan sabha in the jammu and kashmir i think the road is being set by this kind of a legislation coming in it is also good that we have a very proactive nyayik delimitation commission why do i say nyayik because it is headed by a former justice of the supreme court which ensures that whatever recommendations of the commission comes is beyond suspicion or doubt i come to the jammu and kashmir reorganization bill honorable chairman the government has tried to build an inclusive and progressive outlook for jammu and kashmir vidhan sabha through this bill the total seats are 114 seven are being reserved for the scheduled tribes it is a way forward for tribals empowerment my leader shri navin patnaik ji believes in tribal empowerment and we strongly support it one seat is reserved for the displaced people from pok occupied jammu and kashmir who are these people honorable chairman in 1947 when there was pakistani aggression at that time 31779 families were displaced out of that 26319 families stayed back in jnk 5460 families moved on apart from that in 1965 indo pak war 3500 families were displaced in 1971 indo pak war 6565 families were displaced all together 10065 families if you add the previous 1947 it comes to 41000 845 families that have been displaced and providing them a seat is a voice for them in the coming vidhan sabha it's a very good step kashmiri migrants genocide what vivek tankha ji said i strongly support his view there was a genocide in 8990 in kashmir where our kashmiri brothers and sisters had to forcibly leave their land in the middle of the night and run away for fear of life we are providing them a voice today i think this is a very good step in this we are adding one more that a women's representative will be there among these two it's a very good women's <laughs> empowerment move let's come to the data the relief organization of jammu and kashmir says 46517 families are recorded to have moved which comes to 158976 people who were displaced because of this don't they deserve a voice honorable chairman they deserve a voice this bill gives them that voice and therefore my party the bjd and my leader shri navin patnaik ji we support it honorable chairman today they would be watching the television ki chalo aaj to aawaz mil rahi hai us din raat ke andhere mein jaan bacha ke bhagna pada tha ab vidhan sabha mein baithenge hamara bhavishya nirnay karenge ye soch ye vikas unke sath rahe people residing in the union territory of jnk this is not part of the bill this was done earlier but i'd like to reflect on this 24 seats have been reserved for such people who are today not within the jurisdiction of the indian territory they were a part of us they will always stay a part of us and one day we will have the pok they'll be part of the vidhan sabha they will be with us i will sum up the bill my time is running out tribal empowerment through this bill excellent kashmiri migrants get voice excellent women's empowerment excellent displaced people from pok getting a voice excellent now i'll come to the second bill very quickly one minute jammu and kashmir reservation amendment bill 2023 honorable chairman the second bill changes the nomenclature 
of weak and underprivileged classes to other backward classes. This has been brought on the recommendations of whom? Not the government only, ma'am. It has been brought on the recommendations of the Jammu and Kashmir Social and Educationally Backward Classes Commission. A commission has gone into it and said, we must have it. So by the commission's recommendation, it has come. This is to do away with any confusion in giving out certificates. Any doubts, any confusions would be moved away. And this is not the change of name. Naam ke saath samman bhi judra hai aur ye samman ki baat hai aur sirf naam ke vaaste nahi sochna chahiye samman ke saath jod ke sochna chahiye I'll summarize 30 seconds more Both the bills stand to empower the people of Jammu and Kashmir By this bill we reiterate our stand that the entire country 1.4 billion people stand with the people of Jammu and Kashmir we stood with them we stand with them we will stand with them this is a way towards new Kashmir. This is a way towards Naveen Kashmir. This is a way towards a prosperous, peaceful, and strong Kashmir. With these words, on behalf of my leadership, Naveen Patnaik ji, and my Biju Janata Dal party, we support the bills. Thank you. Sri V. Vijay Sai Reddy.